there's this crazy thing that's like, especially as a cradle Catholic, there's like this instinct when something bad happens. Like even before you told me you had uh, uh, six curls, I went like this, right? Yeah. It's like that <laughs> that instinct to make the sign of the cross. I, I, sometimes I'll watch a movie and something bad will happen and so, or somebody's dying and they don't make the sign of the cross and I'm irked by it. Yeah. It's like that that sign of the cross is such a powerful thing. It it <laughs> Anthony, they're making fun of me, Eric, because I'm normally not this. Anthony's being so chill. <laughs> well, it's late, guys, I, and I I don't want to make Eric not want to come back on with us. Um, yeah, it's too late. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, can I tell this funny story, I, Eric? You, so before I ever did anything, I sent Eric um like an article. To, Notice how to, you like, didn't read. wait for him to say yes. You just so went. listen. Listen, I sent Eric an article a while back. It was the first time I ever wrote something. I sent it to Eric. And I'm like, Eric, don't, I'm not asking you to publish this. Just please read it and let me know what you think. So he goes, the, the writing is fine. He goes, but I'm going to tell you right now. He goes, you, you're talking about yourself a lot and nobody gives a crap who you are. <laughs> like He's like, you're not Scott Hahn. Yeah. So it, instead of rewriting the article. A YouTube channel. Instead of rewriting yeah, the article, I said, let me become famous like Scott Hahn and then resubmit the article. There you go. In about <laughs> in about 50 years, it'll be ready. We'll that's be the, able to publish it. That's the then. narcissist in me. No, I'm not going to change what I wrote. I'm going to become as that's famous right. as Scott Hahn so I could get on Just so show. you know, I have actually told that the mo- – I didn't say as – frankly, I only said bluntly to you. But I do get submissions sometimes where people tell a very personal, like the first-person story – and they're nobody knows who they are, so nobody cares, and yeah. that's just the reality. Yeah. Uh, I mean, you got to tell, you got to, you got to be saying something that people are interested in, and you can bring in personal anecdotes. People love those. Yeah, but it can't be a story about you if nobody right. knows who you yeah, are. Exactly. Yeah, and I, I was actually yeah. so grateful for for the event because at first of all, my feelings would never be hers. It was the first time I ever wrote anything, it's like, and I told you, I was like, be brutal to me, like be harsh. <laughs> But um, just even the idea that you've that you've read it, and then you were one of my first guests that ever came on here, Eric. You're you, you're really um, I I'm really really grateful to you. I mean, it's nine o'clock at night. I know the last thing you wanted to do was actually come on here. I hate doing it until I actually get on. Once I get on, I always have fun. But like that lead up to it, I'm like, oh, I hate doing. Well, you this. really you really get nice after nine o'clock, don't you? I'm gonna that's the only thing I'm gonna come on from now on. <laughs> I'm, I'm, earlier, I'm sorry, I said three hours of traffic. I worked in the rain all day. It was terrible. So I got. I got-